Hey guys, welcome back to Marketing Pandas Global. I hope you are doing well today. Well guys, this is the 12th video in this MS PowerPoint course. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to create photo album in PowerPoint. Well guys, it is pretty important to understand photo album creation process in PowerPoint because every time you can't just use your slides or you can't just use a PPT method, presentation method to show your PPT or to show your project in front of your audience, okay? Sometimes if you have only images, if you have your content as an image, then you can use photo album method to show or to present your content in front of your audience. That's why MS PowerPoint has given this option in their software. So let's get understand how you can create a photo album in a PowerPoint software. Let's get into the video without any further ado. So guys, I've already started my PowerPoint software and in order to create or in order to make your photo album, you first have to select a blank presentation. So click on this. This is totally in a new work which I'm doing. Okay. Now, to create a photo album, first you have to click on insert so that we can add the images, right? Because without inserting the images, we can't just create album, right? So in images option, we have the third option over here, photo album. Click on this. And once you click on the image, I mean photo album option, there will be a dialog box like this. First, you have to insert image from. So if I click on this, my file manager will be open where I have to select the images. So I have already downloaded the images here. As you can see, let's select all. I have downloaded around 12 images. So as you can see, pictures in album. So images are added over here and I have downloaded this image from pixabay.com which is a free site where you can download copyright free images and you can use these images anywhere you want in the internet. Okay, now if you want to add or insert text between these two images, you can insert that as well. That is totally up to you if you want to add text like this. Okay, then the photo album will be become of 13 photos. Okay, and if you want to remove this, just check this box and click on remove. Okay, so as you can see 12, 11 photos are over here. Now, if we see a little bit down, here is the album layout option, okay? In this album layout option, the first option we have picture layout, okay? In album layout, first we have fit to slide. So right now we are going this only the fit to slide option and fit to slide option means the image will be fit in a particular slide, okay? One image for one slide, okay? And if you select this one, one picture, okay? So the preview will be like this. As you can see here, this is a preview of uh, your particular or of your actual slide, right? Then if you want to add two images in one slide, then you have to select this. And if you want to four pictures or four images in your slide, then it will be looking like this. So right now I'm going with the fit to slide and it will be totally fit in the particular slide. Okay. Now uh, this option is currently turned off right now because fit to in fit to slide option, this option doesn't work. But if I choose this one, it will be turned on. Okay. But right now I'm going with the fit to slide and click on create. So as you can see, the first slide is photo album by Saurabh Sharma, which is my name. Okay. Then here's our company's logo, marketing funders, our digital marketing agency. Then we have the images over here, one by one, as you can see. And the images I've already told you that I, I have downloaded this image from pexels.com, which is a copyright free platform. Now. After creating the slide or after creating this PPT or you can say photo album, you can just save this as like your PPT. You just have to click on save or save as, but I'm not going to save this one because I'm going to show you one more thing that how you can change it. Like if you want to add four images in particular one slide, okay, how you can do that. Then again, you have to go to insert. As you can see, this is the photo album. Here is one arrow icon. Click on this and here you will be able to see new photo album or edit photo album. So I want to edit this photo. And once I click there, that particular dialog box will be open again. Now I just have to change this into four pictures and it is showing like this. Okay. It will be showing like this without any border, just four pictures will be there in a particular slide. But I want these images with like a particular frame, like simple frame like this black borders, or I can choose other ones as well. Compound frame. Mm -hmm. It looks like then we have center shadow rectangle. If I click on this, no, I want to go this one. So I'm choosing compound frame black. Okay. Then we have some more options over here. You just have to check this box and you will be able to edit these options. If you want to increase the brightness, you can do that. Okay. 
if you want to change or if you want to rotate the image as well you can do that now let me deselect this and click on just update and it will be looking like this mm -hmm. looks nice but the frame which i have chosen isn't that let me go back edit album okay it is compound frame okay this is because the back background is black that's why we are not able to see that particular linings not an issue still it's looking good and i hope you understood how you can create photo albums whether it is one image or whether it is uh, whether you want to add four images in one slide i hope you understood i hope you like the video if you do so please hit that subscribe and like button and still if you have any question or query please comment down below i'll answer those questions we'll meet you in the next video till then bye bye